Is your debt causing you sleepless nights? Knock your debt out with Debt KO. And your debt won't be the only thing keeping you up at night. Debt KO, free impartial advice on all your debt. Andrew McCart, IFL TV in association with MTK Global. I'm here with the winner, Danny Morell. Danny, you are elated when you were getting seen the doctor, when you came out the ring there, you were over the moon. How do you feel right now to be one and all as a professional? Relieved. Relieved? Yeah, I feel like it been a big build up and uh, you don't want to hold it on. No, no, you can hold it. It's, uh, it's been a big build up and, it, and it's done and I'm, I'm, I'm buzzing. I'm one and all as a pro, I can't believe it, I'm buzzing. Um. Talk to me about the fight then. You said to me, we talked a little bit off camera there, that you, you weren't nervous in the first round. For some weird reason, you were nervous in the fourth round. Now, yeah. why was that? Why did you think that was? It felt strange normally when I'm warming up for a fight. I'm nervous as out, proper nervous in the first round. I'm always well known for being quite slow and, and I get into it. But the first two rounds, it felt like surreal. I thought, I'm not nervous. I'm actually boxing more. I don't feel tired. And I sat down and in the end of the second round, I thought, this is real. And then I'm like, oh no, I'm a bit scared. I got like, it shipped me in a little bit. I'm like, oh my God, this I'm having pro debut. And I looked at all the cameras and then I was tired. I'm like, oh no. And then I got a bit nervous and everything and it was weird. Normally it went back to front, but... Uh, and then he started coming forward and I thought, oh no, he's coming forward now. He's actually throwing big punches and that. But no, I, I thought I handled it quite well and I, and I boxed him well. Quite me a good shot in the end and uh, I was trying to learn. That's that was my objective. I just wanted, you know, these years are going to be the learning stages in my pro career. Thanks for handing me. I'm not used to these people taking no, the mic. It's quite good. No, no, sorry, it's sorry. Um, I said to you as well that when I was watching you fight there, I was pleasantly surprised. And the reason being that I, I've seen Dave Dave Allen has showed me some amateur footage of you yeah, on his phone. Now I knew you could, you've got good angles and you could punch, do little bits and pieces. But in there tonight, you seem so relaxed. Your angles were good, you were coming up with different shots, you were different shot selection, it wasn't just one twos, you were coming up with uppercuts and left hooks to the body, you were going at the body as well, you were switch hitting southpaw to orthodox. Yeah. To be honest, for something as pro debut, you, you, you show me something that I didn't think was there and for that, I think you've, you've shown everybody else. What do you think that you've proven tonight then? That makes me really happy because that was my thing. I, I wanted to show that I'm, you know, I'm a good boxer and, and I think I did it. Some, there were some things I thought, you know, I want... I want to be a bit fitter now. I want to get to the right weight because it, it was clearly too big, and uh, and I want to be consistent throughout. I were a bit, you know, I got tired. You know, it is my debut. I can't uh, tell myself off too much, but I were a bit panicky. I was like, oh my god, this is real and all this. But yeah, I thought I thought I boxed well. And so did I. Uh, would Dave Allen think you thought uh, you boxed well? Was he? Is you, you not had a chance to look at your phone yet? But what do you think he's? What do you think he's thinking of your performance tonight? I'm hoping he's buzzing because I'm quite, a lot of people, have, as a walk back, I were a bit iffy, I like, I kept saying to Killer and Connor, I going, am I doing good? I, I don't know, because it's just, I felt like I'm starting my amateur career again. Like, it's a whole new world, and uh, I felt a bit like, sometimes I think, am I, am I doing good or not? I didn't know, but apparently I have, so I'm happy. You certainly did. And another thing that you've got to be proud of is, for an opening fight on IFL TV broadcast, yeah. I'm a, I don't know what the numbers are, but I'm assuming you probably did break the records. 12,500 people Brilliant. tuned in to watch you fight tonight. Uh, how does that make you feel? Amazing. I just want to say thank you for everyone watching at home and supporting me on Instagram. I want to say thank you to my friend James and his company, mm -hmm. Prestige Telecom, that have helped basically made this fight happen. I want to thank everyone else on this T-shirt. Give me, me, me two seconds. I'll pan down. See take the mic away. Everyone else who's paid for the medicals, you know... It, I don't even have to work. I'm lucky enough to say that I don't have to work because these are paying me monthly, monthly wages to keep me boxing every day and training hard. So I want to say thank you to these people because it won't it won't be possible. I want to say thank you to MTK for giving me the opportunity to uh, showcase my skills tonight. I'm buzzing. When's the next one? God knows. I don't know. Uh, as soon as you know, someone says I can get back out. Because uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be in the gym tomorrow. It's a Wednesday, so I'm going to go back to the Ingalls tomorrow. I'm going to carry on training. This is a, a lifestyle now. I look up to Barry. He, he's on treadmill normally after his fight, a 12-round fight. So I want to crack straight back on, straight in the gym tomorrow. See, the thing as well, I, I, I've spoken to you not numerous of times when Dave Allen's been fighting. We've been in Sheffield or wherever we've been for our fights. And you've always been there with Dave. And yeah. you've always been that funny lad cracking jokes. When I interviewed you, interviewed you yesterday, 
there wasn't much joking. You were like, I'm a professional athlete now. I want to learn. And it was all about learning and stuff like that. And I, I read on the, uh, the MTK Instagram that you don't want to be just that fat kid on Instagram or Dave Allen's pal. Yeah, yeah. You want to be Danny Morell, yeah. the professional athlete, don't you? Yeah, that, that's what I mean. I've, it's not summit to our fat. It's a dangerous sport. You know, I've, I got it then. And, and you're like, wow. You know, it's gonna, obviously it's, it's not going to be any easier. It's just going to get harder. So I want to take it serious I, yeah I will put funny posts on Instagram because people love it and, and I love it I, it's still good to be funny but I'm just saying training side of things I want to take it really serious I've got a, you know, a good switch in my mind now that this is a big wake up call you know, I need to crack on for the next God knows how many years of my life I'm just going to dedicate my life to this Final one before I let you go 2021 what are you hoping for being a world champion <laughs> bloody hell <laughs> I'll be surprised that's the dream but uh, no Hopefully more fights like that, more learning fights, and I just want to progress, like I said to you earlier. So when I, when I grow into a man, I think I'm going to be really good. Uh, sometimes I've written Dale then, and you're laughing at me. But, you know, I, look like it. I don't look like a boxer, to be honest, when I take this shirt off. But I'm looking forward to uh, developing and learning and uh, being a professional boxer. One and oh, I can't wait to look at box checking a bit. I can't wait. One and oh. I hope they put a picture on as well. I can't wait. Well, you can send them a picture of yourself. Yeah, well, I'm going to have to. I don't know how but I'm going to do it. I'm going to send a good one as well. Me like this. <laughs> Winning. Well, Danny, I won't give you much longer. You got any final words for your fans out there? Thank you very much for watching. Breaking records, apparently. So, thank you very much. I'm buzzing. Woo! Woo! <laughs> a bit Ric Flair. Good stuff, Danny. Enjoy. Well done, much. well done. Cheers. Is your debt causing you sleepless nights? Knock your debt out with Debt KO. And your debt won't be the only thing keeping you up at night. Debt KO, free impartial advice on all your debt.